I'm in huge debt. What? Why didn't you tell me? Actually, I'm in debt too. Er, you're kidding, right? Amelia and James were married for three years. Amelia was a businesswoman, and James was an accountant. Everything seemed to be going on well for them, and their friends often admired them. You both are so perfect. How do you two manage it all? Well, we know just how to balance our work and personal life, and we manage our expenses so well. One day, James heard a knock on the door. Good day. I have a letter for Mrs. Amelia. James collected the letter and opened it. It was from the bank. The letter stated that Amelia had two months to pay off the loan she owned. Amelia, I don't understand. What's written here? Amelia took the letter and trembled as she read it. She knew she could no longer hide her secret from her husband. I'm in huge debt. What? Why didn't you tell me? I was afraid it would change how you see me. I wanted to handle it on my own. She broke down into tears and explained. A year ago, she decided to start a business. She wanted to start her business and did not have enough money. I'll just borrow from the bank. I can use my car as a collateral. She was granted the loan and was asked to pay back in nine months. Amelia started her business, but it didn't go as she planned. Her business was not booming, so she barely made profit. I wish I didn't start this business. I'm probably going to lose my car. James was heartbroken when he heard her story. While Amelia was still crying, he dropped a bombshell. Actually, I'm in debt too. You're kidding, right? Amelia could not contain her shock. Remember my mom's surgery? I couldn't afford it, so I took a loan. Apparently, the bank decided to take the money from his salary because he was their staff. Everyone. They would detect a certain amount, but the remaining wasn't enough for him to run his home. I've been using our savings to keep up appearances. Amelia was shocked. The savings she wanted to ask him for was gone too. Why didn't you say anything? I didn't want you to think I couldn't provide for us. I was trying to protect you. The couple sat down. Thinking about their financial crisis, they tried to hide it from each other, but now it had been revealed. We can't keep hiding from this. We need to face it together. James suggested that they pay off Amelia's debt first because it was urgent. Then they decided to seek professional help and create a plan to tackle their debts. Amelia started a part-time job at a restaurant, while James took up an online tutoring job. Rather than letting the financial strain tear them apart, they worked together to solve it. It was very tasking, but they were determined. It's difficult, but I'm glad we're doing this together. Yes, it feels like a weight has been lifted. Two months later, they were able to pay off Amelia's debt. Thank you so much, James. They continued their jobs in order to pay off James's debt too. I know we are building our finances, but we also need to rebuild the trust we lost by hiding the truth. As the couple worked through their challenges. They discovered a newfound strength in their honesty. The process not only helped them overcome their financial woes, but also deepened their emotional connection. I promise never to hide anything from you anymore. Me too.